subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi everyone, welcome to Test Prep Training. In this video you will learn about the top interview questions for Microsoft Azure Security Technologies exam. So let's get started. Question number 1, what do you understand by Microsoft Azure? Your answer is, in February 2010, Microsoft originated Azure which is a cloud computing stage. It is an extremely flexible cloud platform that allows development, service hosting, data storage, and service supervision. Question number 2, what do you mean by Azure Security Center? Your answer is, Azure Security Center is an infrastructure security management structure that strengthens the security aspect of your data centers, and allows excellent threat protection over hybrid tasks in the cloud. Azure Security Center provides the proper tools required to solidify the network, secure the services and guarantee that you are on top of your security position. Question number 3, Explain Azure Network Security. Your answer is, firstly, Network security could be described as the process of preserving resources from unauthorized access or attack by applying restrictions to network traffic. The main purpose of Azure network security is to make certain that only authorized traffic is allowed. Question number 4, is Azure Security Center help in improving the security infrastructure? Explain. Your answer is, yes, Azure Security Center help in improving the security infrastructure. Azure Security Center increases the security presence by assisting identify and perform the solidifying responsibilities prescribed as security best methods, and administer them across the machines, data services, and apps. This process includes managing and implementing the security approaches, and guaranteeing the Azure Virtual Machines, non-Azure Servers, and Azure PaaS services are obedient. Question number 5, Explain Data Encryption at Rest Your answer is Data encryption at rest is intended to block the attacker from entering the unencrypted data by getting sure the data is encrypted when on disk. Data encryption at rest is available for services across the cloud paradigms like platform as a service, software as a service, and infrastructure as a service. Question number 6, what is the purpose of network access control? Your answer is, the purpose of NAC is to provide access to your practical machines and assistance only to the authorized users and devices. Question number 7, which network access control does Azure supports? Your answer is, Azure supports many sorts of network access control, such as 1. Route control and force tunneling 2. Network layer control 3. Virtual network security appliances Question number 8, what are the Azure security policies? Your answer is 1. A security policy defines the aimed composition of your workloads and advocates in making certain that you're complying with the security necessities of your business or regulators. 2. Azure Security Center offers its security recommendations based on your chosen policies. Security Center policies are reliant on policy actions designed in Azure Policy. Question number 9. What are the options generally offered by Security Center to operate with security policies? Your answer is, the options provided by Security Center to operate with security policies are, view and edit the built-in default policy. Also, add your own custom policies. In addition, add regulatory compliance policies. Question number 10, what are network security groups? Your answer is, NSGs or network security groups, consolidate a list of commands of access control lists that either support or reject network traffic to subnets, NICs, or both. Network security groups are often associated with subnets or individual NICs attached to a subnet. The ACL controls will implement to all the VMs in the subnet that is connected with an NSG. Question number 11, can traffic to an individual NIC be controlled when an NSG is directly associated with a NIC? Your answer is, yes, a traffic to an individual NIC can be controlled, when an NSG is directly associated with a NIC. Question number 12, can you secure your data for transport in the cloud? Explain. Your answer is, yes, one can secure their data for transit in the cloud. In order to guard the data during transit from one spot to another, guarantee there is no leakage with the encryption key implemented to the data that you are transferring. Question number 13, what do you understand by advanced threat protection? 
Your answer is. Advanced threat protection refers to monitoring your logs to recognize exceptional performance, and possibly malicious attempts to access or misuse databases. Alerts are created for suspicious actions such as potential data infiltration, SQL injection, and brute force attacks or for irregularities in access models to catch privilege accelerations, and breached credentials use. Question number 14. How does an Azure security engineer operate? Your answer is. Azure security engineers often work as part of a larger team committed to cloud-based administration and security, and may also secure hybrid environments as part of end-to-end -end support. Question number 15. What do you understand by roles in Azure? Your answer is. Roles are nothing servers in layman's terms. These servers are maintained, load-balanced, platform-as-a-service virtual machines that operate together to accomplish a common purpose. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.